Hey guys, I thought I'd make a quick video since this whole nerf thing blew up and everyone has their own opinions. Um, first of all, I want to start off by saying I'm just a guy. Don't listen to me if you don't care. Um, and for your own sake, if you don't care, don't go to the comments saying I really don't care about your opinion because then it does mean that you care. Uh, I'm not trying to piss you off or judge you. If you disagree with, if you disagree with me, it's all copacetic. I really don't mind. I just felt like this needed to be said. The very first time I saw this game, played by Northern Lion. Come down here, look at, don't relax, relax I'll handle it. <laughs> I definitely <laughs> killed you. <laughs> I knew it was gonna be good. Aliens were coming in from all directions, a squad of space marines were blasting them back in the face, and even beginner bot missions were like, near impossible. And life was good. I watched like 10 hours of Helldivers straight before I even bought the game. And you know what? No one had even unlocked the railgun, shield generator, or the breaker. Now think back to your own first time playing this game. When you first loaded it into the tutorial, and then your first mission, did you think, this game is absolutely unplayable because I don't have a high damage bolter shotgun to chew through all the enemies? Or did you think, hell yeah, for democracy, and spend every moment you had thinking when the next time you can get on the computer and play it was gonna be? I think everyone is quick to dislike people changing things you're used to. Listen to me say this next bit. It is fine to complain about that. It's fine to feel frustrated and pissed off that someone took the thing you want to play with away. And if you feel like you really can't play the game anymore, then I'm sorry, an awesome game has been made unplayable for you. However, I think I speak for most of us that a lot of us weren't using the exact combination of breaker, railgun, and shield gun in the first place. We still like playing the game. If you can take a step back and at least try out the game a little, I'm sure you smart gamers can figure out new strategies of completing Helldive. And if you can't, if you really can't, then I'm sorry to say it like this, but you're missing out on a sick-ass frickin' game. Meanwhile, all of us over here will be smashing bugs and bots with the best of them. And if you need to play a game where you're easily demolishing hordes of enemies, and I'm only partially joking here, folks, boot up Minecraft in creative and drop TNT on a bunch of zombies, or play Gary's mod, play around with rocketing assets of dummies, or even go back to another game you like and enjoy like Warhammer 40k or Deep Rock Galactic or Remnant 2. There's tons of great games out there, seriously. But it's really not our problem if we're over here having fun playing a game you no longer like. So don't blame the rest of us for it. On the other side of the coin, don't hate the people that are pissed. They really just like the game, and they want to save it. Don't worry guys, you don't have to save the game. It doesn't need it. I'm sure the hardworking and de dedicated devs have looked into many more things than your typical gamer who's been playing it for 50 hours. I mean, they've been developing this game for years, so they probably noticed that the railgun is unlocked at level 20 and not level 5. Also, this is the most important thing in this video. Do not hate and harass the devs for making a game you like so much. It's obvious. That's it. Now for some questions you may have, should I still buy this game? I know many gamers are still waiting to get it. If you want my personal recommendation, this game is still far and beyond worth it. Those of you that will go through the game without ever knowing the previous patch won't be missing anything. I swear to you. Also, I know I'm gonna get hate in the comments, I've already accepted it and moved on. If you guys have any thoughts or opinions on my frankly irrelevant rant, let me know in the comments. I'm curious to hear what the fanbase is thinking. I'm just a guy, so don't trust me. Just evaluate my comments on the basis of my reasoning. Don't trust me. If you F with my vibe, consider subscribing. I make Helldivers videos for fun and I'm trying to get better at it. I'm trying to create a platoon of soldiers that just enjoy playing the game and have fun. Um, closing thoughts. Don't optimize the fun out of playing. The best part of Helldivers isn't when you're alive, it's when you die. It's equal parts hilarious and overwhelming, which is exactly why this game took off in the first place. I'm gonna keep making this channel because I like it and it's fun. Um, in a sentence, no, I don't think it's unplayable. Just have fun playing your digital toys and chill out, go with the flow. I'm sure the devs aren't trying to ruin their own game, at least not for acquisition by another studio. Ahem, <clears throat> ahem, cough, cough. I promise you'll learn to get better at other guns if you just play the game. I mean, have you seen the flamethrower now? Insane! Seriously, why is no one talking about the real important part of this update? They added fire tornadoes to the game? Frickin' fire tornadoes? 
bro.